But first, Marivette is out and about. What is she up hey, to? Oh, Thai Town. Hey. That's right. Good morning. We're at the only place in LA where you can get authentic Thai breakfast at six in the morning. We're visiting a bunch of cool places in Thai Town today. Stick around. Well, the Thai New Year is coming up, so what better place to visit than where Marivette is right now, out and about <laughs> there in Thai Town in Hollywood? And hey, what's going on there, Mark? Good morning, Tony. We are in Thai Town here in East Hollywood. Did you know it's the only officially designated Thai Town in the entire country? And we're back here in the kitchen of Siam Sunset Restaurant. Sam is cooking up some Thai donuts. It smells so good and fresh and sweet and yummy. So this is the only place in LA where you can get authentic Thai breakfast at six in the morning. And I said, you know what? We're doing a culinary uh, tour of Thai Town. That's so right. who else am I going to bring but Jet Tilla, world-renowned chef Hello. and hometown culinary hero. Now, Jet, why do you love Siam Sunset Restaurant so much? And what are these fabulous folks digging into right it's now? It's the only place in LA, if not America, to get hey, Thai guys. breakfast. <laughs> uh, so we've got a ginger soup with tofu. We've got rice porridge. Again, it's it's the only place at 6 a.m. It's the only place in Thai town that all Thai people come and enjoy breakfast. How are you liking this? Oh, I love it. It's a perfect uh, combination of sweetness and spicy in the morning. I love wow. it. I tried it earlier. It does have a nice kick because of the ginger. And so what are some of the other specialties that are here at Siam Sunset? So, um, and Thai people always start the day with Chinese donuts because a lot of us are Thai Chinese. That's what and Sam was cooking. It's fried dough with a little bit of condensed milk. That's delicious. So you want to start with a little sweet. And then you have a little bit of soy milk as you saw before now you got to go to the porridge so the savories there's rice soup so think about the most delicious soup in the world cook a little bit of jasmine rice and then there's rice soup and then the other thing is the rice porridge yum yum okay you guys we are going to head out to a few more places you don't want to miss this lots of yummy food coming your way tony all right mar thanks so much <laughs> bring some of it back all right, you welcome back so mar yeah. is out and about she's out and about she's out and about so she is always out and, and about, about. Under oh. all circumstances. And she's, where is she this time? <laughs> Hi, Mar. She's in Thai Town. We're doing our joke that no one gets. Now. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Guess what? What? I am at Bon Kanom Thai, <laughs> which literally means House of Thai Desserts. We're in the heart of Hollywood in Thai Town. How'd you like your toast already buttered and sugared? Okay, that's what I'm talking about. This is like the Thai Willy Wonka. Come take a look. We've got some bananas in sugar, syrupy. Look at this. Crispy egg yolks with sugar. Are you kidding me? Mung bean fruits. Now, I'm here with Jet Tilla, world-renowned chef and culinary hometown hero. Resident of Thai Town, the mayor, as, as Anthony Bourdain said. Yes, no, you brought yeah. Anthony Bourdain here on no reservations. That's right. Because this is a place, more than 500 different desserts. Just take a look at the shelves stacked with stuff if that you're going to thousand. Oh, and this is the only place you can find it in America, if not the world. I mean, like you said, if you can't get it, if you if you don't come here, you have to go to Thailand. That's okay, the only and, and I'm not getting on an 18 hour flight. That's what I'm saying. Okay, so I want to introduce you to the man responsible for all of this action. Now, Alvin, your yeah. family started this place about 15 years ago. Yes. And and what are you making right now? These things are delicious. Right now we're making the crispy crepe. Or as I call it, a Thai taco. Yeah, basically, and there's two different uh, types. Actually, there's a sweet and a savory. Now, think about the crepe bottom, as you can see as I was doing. And um, on the inside, we have a meringue, which is made of egg whites. And the two toppings is the yellow one is a sweet one, which is sweetened egg yolk. Oh, and, go ahead. Mm -hmm. And the orange one is a savory one, which is coconut and shrimp. Crazy, coconut and shrimp, because that's the whole Thai thing, right? You gotta have yeah. a little sweet and the savory. And if this is so fast, just come take my tour. This is one of the stops on the tour. You'll get to see the entire operation and three other restaurants. So that's right, so go. Jed's doing tours. You have to go to myfoxla.com. MyFoxLA.com, we have all the info, and come on down. This stuff is so good. I'm ready for a taco. Let's do it. Cheers. Cheers to you. Thank you. Hey, you remember this? Welcome back. Our Mari Vet is out and about today. She's in Thai town having a lot of fun. You're at the market now, the historic Thai market? It is the historic Thai market, Maria, that has, by the way, tapatio. You know I had to find my tapatio sauce. Now, it's called Bangkok Market. We're on Melrose. This is the first Thai market, not only in Los Angeles, but in the entire country. We've got our beautiful Thai musicians because you know what? Thai New Year's coming up and they have a big celebration here this weekend. Now this is Mama Tila, this is Mary, and this is her son Jed who's been giving us a culinary tour of Thai Town all morning. Now, 
When you started this, were there many Thai businesses going around? No, we are the first market in Los Angeles. Wow, okay, now we've got a little demo going here, one of the traditional Thai dishes. Jet, what are you cooking up? It is smelling good. We're making Thai basil stir fry, and this is basically a quintessential dish found all throughout Thailand, and the basic flavors are, everything's based around yum, hot, sour, salty, sweet. So around got, yum. Yum, so remember, the yum is hot, sour, salty, sweet. I've got the chili in there, I've got a little fish sauce going in and fresh Thai basil. Thai basil is so important. Picked from my garden. Yeah, no, not really from my garden. From the garden. It's the Bangkok Market yeah, Garden, exactly. okay. So all that goes in there. And again, we're just checking until the shrimp's done completely. Is this a traditional dish that um, that the Thai people, the Thai people, yeah. that Thai people eat for Thai New Year? Every day, absolutely, okay. yeah. So you for don't Thai need a holiday. No, you don't need a holiday, but for Thai New Year, definitely, you'll see this dish on the booths when Hollywood is closed on Saturday. Actually, on Sunday. Now, this is part of your culinary tour that you're actually doing where folks out there in TV yeah. land can come and experience this for yourself. Absolutely. I take about a group of about 15 to 20 people and I show them the best of Thai Town. I show them my Thai Town that I grew up in that I'm very proud of. Yes. All right, you guys, we have all the info on MyFoxLA.com. We've got more coming up next. We're going to send it back to you. Thank you, Mar. But first, Mari Bet is out and about. She's been spending some time in Thai Town. What's up now? Look, look at these gorgeous ladies, Maria. It's Songkran, which is Thai New Year going on. They have a big celebration this Sunday. We have our lovely ladies from the North Hollywood Thai Temple. You know what? We're in Bangkok Market right here on Melrose. And I have to say, I'm having a good time plundering the aisles. Jet Tilla, this is your family store, the first Thai market, not only in LA, but in the entire country. Yep. We've got palm juice, which is really sweet. They've got, I mean, are you kidding me? Pickled banana blossom, what the heck? Anything you need to make Thai food is here. Aloe vera dessert, I mean, it's not just for sunburns anymore. And did you know, the OG Red Bull comes from Thailand. That's why you guys are always so amped up. That's why we're always hyper. That's why we're always cray cray. Old Hashtag Thai. cray cray. Now tell us, this is one of the great dishes that you make, not only just for the for the Thai New Year, but right. you know, it's a traditional Thai dish. It's a kind of an upscale dish. It's called pineapple fried rice, and we use our Thai jasmine rice because the best jasmine rice in the world comes from Thailand. And then uh, basically put in there a uh, fresh carved pineapple, a little bit of shrimp, and then of course the yum ingredients, right? Yeah, tell us a little bit about this whole yum thing. Basically, hot, sour, salty, sweet goes into all Thai food, and those ingredients are in here. Watch what I do. I basically take this, and then I take a pineapple, and I hollowed it out as my bowl. So look at that little functional. Oh, it's all about pretty bowl. presentation. It is. You eat with your eyes, as, as Thai people will tell you before you actually eat. So this will go to the table. I love it. So there's no durian fruit in this, right? Check oh, this out. This yeah. is a durian fruit. This is very prickly. I do have and, durian fruit for you, though. And this is the famous one that's super stinky. Yeah. Well, you know, it's all. It all depends who, who's who's eating it, right? Some people love it. Some people hate it. It is on the strong side. So so this part. market has been around since what? The 60s? 1972 was, it, was when we opened, and uh, it was before I was born, clearly. Yeah, and right? before I was born. And I was uh, monkeying around here, like you know, on the rice bags, packing groceries. So I grew up here. There's Mama right there. Check out Mama Tila. <laughs> Mama. We're shooting you, shooting us. There you go. <laughs> We're having a good time. And you know what? I mean, this really is the largest community of Thai people outside of Thailand itself, right here in East Hollywood, guys. I mean, who knew? It's called Absolutely. the 77th province. We're so big with the 77th province. So come out this weekend and hang out with Thai people at Thai New Year. Thank you, guys. We're going to send it back to you. Well, thank you. That was terrific.